So the following are food items. Study them carefully and use them to answer the questions that follow. So I, we have identified the food items labeled I to I. Then. So I is a fish. I, I is carrots. I, I, I is yam. Ivan is pineapple. Now let's use the food items to fill the table below. So I gives you protein. I, I gives you vitamin A. I, I, I gives you carbohydrates. I even gives you vitamin C. The next question is, use the food items above to give an example of a balanced diet in Ghana. So, the food items, we have yam, so we can prepare yam with carrot seal, and then fish. Then you can have um, a pineapple juice after eating the main meal. So Ivan says, mention two deficiency symptoms of each of the nutrients mentioned in AII. So the last question says, mention two deficiency symptoms of each of the nutrients above. So the deficiency for protein is Pasioko and then marasmus. Then for carrots, which gives you vitamin A is nice blindness. And then xeruxalmia has to do with abnormality on the cornea. Then lack of carbohydrates will lead to hypoglycemia and also fatigue or dizziness. And lack of vitamin C will lead to scurvy and also slow wound healing. So just study the diagram below and answer the questions. So we have I to IX and we expected to name all the parts. So I is the mouth, I, I is the esophagus, I, I, I is the stomach, I vein is the liver, vein is the gallbladder, vein I is the pancreas, vein I, I is the large intestine, vein I, I is the small intestine, vein I, I, I is the large intestine. IX is the rectum, X is the anus. So the II says name the parts of the digestive system where digestion of food occurs. So name all the parts. So digestion of food occurs in the mouth, in the stomach, in the duodenum, which is a small intestine, and then the ileum as well. Then the B says where digested food is absorbed into the bloodstream. So digested food is absorbed into the bloodstream in the small intestine, which is the ileum. Then the IIIC is named the end product of digestion that is absorbed in the bloodstream. So the end products absorbed into the bloodstream include amino acid, fatty acid and glycerol, and then glucose. So the students perform tests on three food substances, A, B, and C. The table below represents the tests and observations made by the students. Study it carefully and answer the questions that follow. So we have A, B, and C. So when we read through the tests and the observations, realize that for the first one, we are dealing with telling solution. The telling solution is a test for reducing sugars. So we are already answering the I. Then the B which is iodine is used to test for starch. Then C, which has them to do with testing with the myelin reagent, is used to test for protein. And the II says, name one source each of the food substances A, B, and C. So A, one source is banana, which is for the reducing sugar. Then the B, which is a starch, is cassava. C, which is protein, is fish. The importance of the food substances to the body. So A, which is banana, banana is a good source of energy. B, that I mentioned as cassava, is also a good source of energy. Then C, helps to repair one out issues. So I can say, what happens to a person who lacks food C in a diet?
So the person who lacks skin in his or her diet will have reduced muscle mass.